Kenya and Tanzania used President Samia Sulu Hassan's two-day state visit to press the reset button after months of strained diplomatic and trade relations. President Uru Kenyatta, while hosting President Samia in her maiden state visit two months after she took over following the demise of her predecessor, John Pombe Magufuli, said Kenya and Tanzania were not only neighbors, but brotherly nations with historical ties in culture, language, and trade that should be enhanced through speedy resolution of border hitches and friction on taxation whenever they occur. Francis Gashuri reports on the Samir Kenyatta prescription. Tanzania President Samia Sulu Hassan's choice of a maiden state visit was strategic and significant. Her host, President Uhuru Kenyatta, rolling out the red carpet, signifying a change in the often frosty relations between the East Africa community member states. President Samia, barely two months after taking over from the late John Pombe Magufuli, has embraced a more reconciliatory stance. As she reaches out to Tanzania's partner states and smoothens the rough edges that characterized her predecessor's first term in office. Safari hii yako, natupatia nafasi ya renew bilateral relations zetu. Ninalo taka kuliweka msisitizo, ni lile linalo husu kukuza na kuimarisha usiano na ushirikiano kati ya mataifa yetu mawili. Na hili ndilo jambo la msingi kama alivyo sema, Tanzania na Kenya sio tumajirani lakini ujirani wenyewe ni wakindugu. At the heart of the latest diplomatic spat between Kenya and Tanzania last year were modalities established by President Kenyatta's administration to tame the spread of coronavirus, including closing the borders between the two nations, a move that triggered retaliatory action from the departed president's regime, leading to a near paralysis in transportation of goods between the two nations. Ni kwa maziri wetu wa afya kukaa na kuangalia, kurahisisha mfumo wa kuingia na 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 kuchekiwa kwenye mambo haya yaliyoingia ya covid au corona watu wetu wapate huduma za haraka kupima kuchekiwa ili waweze kupita na biashara ziendelee Though the late President Magufuli had toured Kenya in October 2016 and accorded a state reception, relations between the two nations were lukewarm, often straining free trade. Na mawaziri wetu wamewambiwa wahakikisha ya kwamba wanakutana mara kwa mara, wahakikisha ya kwamba wanaendelea kuzingatia usiano wetu na kuweza kutatua shida ndogo ndogo ambazo ilasumbua wanaichi wetu wakati wanafanya biashara kati yao wakati wanatembelea na kati yao Samia's visit seeking to straighten the diplomatic bands Kiangalia mipaka inayozunguka Kenya mpaka wao na Tanzania ndio mkubwa kuliko mipaka ya nchi nyingine zote lakini kwenye mpaka huo wale wanaoishi mipakani wako Tanzania wako Kenya na wote ni ndugu kwa hiyo uhusiano wetu ni wa kindugu to further extend the hand of friendship and open a new chapter in the two nations' ties, President Samia invited President Kenyatta to grace Tanzania's 60th independence anniversary in December this year. President Samia Sulu Hassan's two-day state visit is primarily meant to mend the broken diplomatic and trade ties between Kenya and Tanzania, triggered by her predecessor, the late John Pombe Magufuli. After talks with President Uhuru Kenyatta and the signing of a series of deals, President Samia addresses a joint sitting of parliament tomorrow afternoon before her departure from Nairobi. Francis Bashuri, Citizen TV, State House, Nairobi.